So here we are. We are now on i3. I have to film now with two screens. You see one on the left and one on the right. Everything is uh, set on my machine, of course. We still have to do some things. So what did I do out of the box? Out of the box, I have told you, I've told the system to start on the workspace one, which we're looking here, the left, to start Firefox. Okay, so we can start another program, no problem. I've also told him to go to start the sublime text on page, not wait page, but workspace two. So one, two. Okay, on the other screen, the pages from six, seven, eight, nine, ten will come, and on the left page, one, two, three, four, five. And everything is still, well, a bit strange. So Spotify already works, it's already started, didn't do a thing. So I've programmed i3 to start Firefox, to start Sublime Text, and to start my file manager, which is not Nautilus in um, Solus. And I have told them to start Spotify. You know? And that's what happened. Let's now fix it a little bit in that sense that we want it to be a beautiful system. So this is not an icon set I like. It's an, it's another kind of desktop, so it gets its information somewhere else. So what we're going to do is, uh, by the way, I'm going to press Windows 4. The wallpapers worked. I saw it in the behind, so we're actually not working with the real i3. We have a gap in between here. So gaps between... Um, Mirrors is fun because then you can see besides the borders and you see the wallpaper change and then you go quickly to Windows 4 for instance or yeah just Windows Touch or Super Key uh, 4 and that is our wallpaper you go to the variety little icon on the right I scroll over it and there you go that's my next one that's my next one and the nice thing is when you press Windows Enter then you have and terminal but the terminal is not yet transparent so let's fix a lot of stuff now so to how to make this beautiful since this is uh, yeah it is it's a new computer the settings have been applied but you still have to do some stuff so let's go ahead Windows D and you get on the right uh, screen at the top you get menus we did install LX appearance we're gonna say, sorry, but Relay is not our icon theme. We want to have, uh, not not icon, but not our theme. We have made Arc Dark and Arc Dark Evil Pop, Arc Dark Orange. These things are on the Solus, uh, Ultimate Solus GitHub. Uh, so why not, uh, I don't know, Arc Dark Evil Pop, whatever. You choose something, but something nicer than this, which was Relay, I think color you can't change anything so you move on icon team i do have a surfing evil pop so the same bluish uh, colors will apply to the folders later on and then the mouse cursor is already nice i love my breeze snow font can be changed not really and that's it apply close closing any program any application you do that with windows shift q you hover with your mouse over something, Windows, Shift, Q. It's gone. Pressing Windows, Shift, Enter. And then you get your Nautilus again, your file manager again. So that's interesting to know. And Windows, Enter is going to be your terminal always. So you have your Windows, Terminal, Windows, Shift, File Manager. Those, those two things are the main things to remember, I think. Okay, so as you can see, it's not nice, but uh, then again, we did not log off or log on. Sometimes things can kick in. If you press Windows Shift R, that's a reload for R. The thing is, you won't do that with uh, icons. So I'm going to log off and log on and save this film and do a third film. 